welcome again guys to my channel if you are a new youtuber you will know that for you to be able to monetize your channel you need 4000 watch hours and 1000 subscribers and getting these 4000 watch hours is, is not an easy thing for you to do so in this video i'm going to share a strategy with you whereby you can easily get these 4000 watch hours within a short period of time some of you are complaining that you have gotten to 1,000 subscribers, but getting your 4,000 watch hours is difficult. That is why I've come up with this video to show you how to get these 4,000 watch hours using silent live stream without even showing your face. You can do this live stream and get your 4,000 watch hours easily for free. What you need for you to be able to do this is your mobile phone or you can use your laptop to do this. And everything in this video is going to be completely free for you to be able to do them. Go to this website, restream.io. So the first website which you see here, you click on the website and create an account. After creating an account, you will come to the home page just like this so you use your google to create an account on this website that's your google email to create an account after creating an account you come to this particular interface like this is to come here click on channels so first we will need to link our youtube channel you can do this live stream on facebook youtube twitch twitter so um, you can add other channels from here. So I'm going to click on connect because we are using this for our YouTube channel. I'm going to click on connect YouTube channel. So from here, you select channel, not event, select channel. So from here, you connect. So they will ask you to choose um, the email address you want to use. So let me just quickly select the email address I want to use. So you select if, if your YouTube channel, if the email address if the Google account you are using, if there are several YouTube channels on that Google account, they will ask you to select the one you want to go with. So for this, I want to go with um, this particular one. So from here, I'll click on continue. So from this, they will tell you this, manage your YouTube video account. So uh, make sure this is ticked. Then come down here and click on continue. So you can see what is written here. They say YouTube requires you to enable live streaming on your channel before you can stream. So if live streaming is not enabled on your channel, you can simply click on enable live streaming and it's going to take you to that particular channel that you have just linked. And we are going to enable live streaming on that channel. So when you go to that channel, they will, you, you request for, if your channel was not enabled for live streaming, you make sure that is you request for it by going to using that link which i just so from here we can go ahead to create our new stream to create your new stream you can simply click on the create a new stream upload videos or record or you can simply click here where you see new stream i'm going to click on new stream now you can simply do this with your phone it's available on your phone so you can just go to the website on your web browser on your phone and you can just follow along with this video so from here you click on stream a list of pre-recorded videos that is the playlist so i'm going to click on that so when you click on that they will say this getting the videos ready after that you are going to see something like this so from here, if you don't like this background, you can simply change the background. You click on add a video file by clicking on this add a video file. Or you can come here and click on add a add video. So I'm going to just click on this center to add a video file. So build your playlist and schedule it to go live. So I'm going to click on upload video here. So it's going to take you to your file manager where you can select any video that you want to upload so let me just look for a very simple video that i can make i can demonstrate this to you click on the video you want to upload and click on open and my video has been is uploading now make sure that your video file size is not more than 250 mb so from here you can upload another video you can import from youtube so let's just click on this import from youtube and we have linked our channel so here we can import videos you can also import playlists if you have a playlist on your channel you can use this option to import your playlist 
But if you don't have a playlist on your channel, you can simply go ahead and create playlists on your channel, moving videos to that playlist so that you can import playlists. So for here, let's just import a video. So I'm going to click on videos, import videos. So it's going to analyze my channel, bringing in all the videos I have on that channel. And this is these are just three videos that I have on the channel. So I want to use this for the live stream. So you can select anyone, you can select the three of them. And from here, you click on import. So here, if you are using the free plan, you'll be able to import only one video at a time. So select the one video and click on import. And when your video has been imported, from here you can select, you can select the video, click on the video, and then from this downside, you click on add to playlist. And you can see the video will be added to this playlist. You can see the video here that has been added. So from here, you can change the background. If you don't like this background, you can come to your right hand side here. You can see design. If you click on design, you can add this lower third under your video. Um, there are different things you can add overlay under your video. There are different things. This is the background. If you don't like the background, you can simply select any background. You can see that background has been added under my video. You can add caption by going to these captions. You can add a QR code, you can add notes, you can add chats under your video, maybe overlay, make it overlay on your video. Then you can click on settings and um, do some little settings here. And when you are satisfied, and click here to take a preview to see how this um, video looks like. Then when you are satisfied, you click on schedule stream. When you click on schedule stream, they are going to ask you to choose your stream title, description, and thumbnail. So you can just give a title. So let's say um, um let's say African folk um let's say the weakest step model. Then you can come, you can come here and give a description. It's optional. You can give a description, but it's optional. You can just write something there depending on the the video that you uploaded then you can come here select the date that you want this live stream to um to come live so i want it to come live by um, 31st so you can set the time here this is my local time which is lagos nigeria um africa lagos so if, if depending on the country you are you can set your time there then create an event page on social platforms then from this dancer, you can select to add thumbnail to this um, live stream. So I'm going to click on add thumbnail. So from here, I'm just going to select a random image that I have available here. So let's say this image, I'll click on open. Then I'll come down. So this is the thumbnail. You make sure you crop. So uh, crop. Then you come down and click on next. And when you do that, um, you will come up here. They say, choose where your video should stream. So I'm going to choose if you connected your Facebook, the Twitch, the Twitter, you can um, turn them off or turn them on. So for this, I only connected YouTube. So I'm going to click on turn on. You can see I've turned that on. Um, I've turned that on. So I'm going to come down here. They say you can add channels and all that. So uh, make sure it's turned on. The first one here, which is the channel which you added, make sure it's turned on. Then you come down here and click on create event. And when that has been done, you will see on my right hand side here, you can see they say starting in one day. So when that time which you set, when it gets to that time which you set, your live, your video, your live stream is going to come live and people will start watching. So when the streams for a day and you're satisfied, you can simply come back here and stop the live streaming and you can check how many watch hours that you have gotten and how many subscribers that you have gotten from this live streaming and this is how you gain these um, subscribers and watch hours at the same time for your youtube channel thank you guys for watching if you want to see more of my videos like this video and subscribe to the channel let me know in the comment section if this video was helpful and you can check several of my videos on this channel is going to be helpful to you.